So we talk about love, right? Love, it, it may not have an age, right? Uh, it, it, you know, that's what they say. <laughs> uh, this is a, a, an interesting case here, an uh, interesting situation. This 24-year-old woman, 24 years old. You remember when you were 24 years old? I remember when I was 24 years old. But 24-year-old woman is making plans to have her first child with her, <laughs> wait for it, 85-year-old husband. She has an 85-year-old husband, if you're watching us uh, on, uh, on fire-tv.com, on YouTube, uh, DJ Diamond K, or on Facebook. You can see a picture of this happy couple. <laughs> they look happy, right? Uh, they're from Mississippi. Her name is Miracle. She is 24 years old, and she is married to 85-year-old Charles. All right? Here's her dad. Right? Here's her father. You can see the expression on his face. He, he doesn't look too happy to me. I don't know how happy I would be uh, if this was my son-in-law either, but uh, I guess love is love, and, and she's in love, in love. He's in love. Now, despite their age gap, Miracle is looking to uh, cash in, oh, it's a, cash in, uh, uh, create <laughs> uh, uh, two beautiful children with Charles despite knowing that she's probably going to outlive him. She's 24. He is 85. Now, the couple is looking into uh, IVF. Charles says that he wants to leave behind a generation. Charles is a retired real estate agent who caught feelings for Miracle, who used to do his laundry a year after knowing her. <laughs> Used to do her laundry. Okay. Uh, I mean, I guess uh, uh, she's, she used to do the laundry, uh, and uh, I guess she's still doing the laundry. Right? <laughs> uh, I got your know, love is love. Okay. Uh, she says that one day he waltzed in, threw a piece of paper down, and said, write down your number. She said he was a player. He was her knight in shining armor. She said about their relationship. I don't know. If my 24-year-old family member was married to or dating an 85-year-old, I just, I don't know. I just, I understand that people love, you can't control who you love and all of that. She said that they got a good vibe going. She said he didn't make her feel weird. She said that the conversation was good. Sometimes me talking to my nieces who are teenagers, Sometimes we just like we talking past each other. It, it, you know, the generation gap's not that big between me and my nieces or well, me and my nephews, but 24 and 85 said that he got a good vibe. When I found out I was in too deep, it was a couple of months in, she said. I already had feelings for him. He was my baby and he wasn't going anywhere. That, that's, you know, that, that's that sugar daddy talk, right? I don't know if I'm going for that. I mean, I, I guess love is love. Maybe maybe I'm being too hard on them. Maybe, maybe I'm being too hard on them. I, I guess they look happy. I, I guess. I don't know. When you, looking at her father, I think that pretty much sums it up. Let me know your thoughts in the comment section, Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, LinkedIn, TikTok, at the Dominic K Show, of course, on fire-tv.com.